seven-year-old Rinta Amor protesting in Long Island, New York. Historically, children have always been essential in the fight for equal rights. In 1963, thousands of black kids marched to protest segregation in Birmingham, Alabama, part of a strategy to keep the protests nonviolent. But instead, they were met with force. We've seen recent demonstrations turn violent across the country, police clashing with protesters and kids sometimes caught in the mix. In Seattle, police investigating this incident, a young girl allegedly maced by an officer at a protest. But some officers are trying to change the narrative. This one in Houston calming this frightened five-year-old after she asks, are you going to shoot us? cry for equality going viral his song even shared by president obama bryant says music is in him and it was his way of expressing his feelings during these times i really have hope that we could change the world um with all of our gifts if we can just come together and not be divided and we could all be equal i just want to live parents at these protests say that they included their kids so that their kids could see how change happens, do their part, and have their voices heard. And guys, if one 